Hey everybody, this is Guru Francis, Big Boy Extreme. We're on today's another FMA tutorial, and now we're gonna take we're gonna take this to the next level as far as the the huba technique is concerned. I have my student David here to help me. So now, what we were doing earlier, where we're just doing inside outside pass, inside outside pass, inside outside pass, right? But now we're gonna take it to the next level. We're gonna go inside outside pass. He's gonna leave it here, inside outside pass. Then he's gonna strike me from this side this time, and I'm gonna go outside, inside, pass, and I'm gonna go up, there we go, good. Then we're gonna go back to the original, here. Good, 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 okay, good. Good, all right, so what you're noticing now is that when he's here and then he passes me, this way, he's gonna come up here straight to my face. And then my hand is already here to block, then I huba, then I come in and do the exact same thing, and we're back to original position. Inside, outside, pass. Inside, outside, pass. Inside, outside, pass. Good. Good. Now, what? when you get a little bit more advanced, you go inside, outside, pass. I don't let go of this. Inside, outside pass. If you notice, then my as soon as I'm here, my hand goes into palm up so I can push his hand up. Right? So he goes here. Good. Then he goes bam. So here's what I want you guys to notice. That the moment that we go inside, outside pass, inside, outside pass, my hand switches from above to below. So the, this can strike here. Pass, good. Here, good. 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 Palm, I'm sorry, palm push here. This goes up this way. My hand checks him out down here, and he passes, then he comes up here. Why is that important? Because we want to start, we want to make sure that we still employ the, the panga of the buaya or the jaws of the alligator. So the moment, that he goes inside, and that he, he goes, try to hit me in the forehead, inside, outside, pass inside, my hand comes up here this way. Here, he passes it this way. I notice that I can sense that when he's already moving his hand away from me, so that something's coming up this way. Why is that coming up that way? Because, sorry, <laughs> that my hand is here. He can't go down. Try to go down, and he can't, right? So subconsciously, he already knows that he can only go up. That's where I'm telling him to go. So this is what, when we were talking about in, in another video, the Kawi, the third level of the Kawi is telling your opponent where to go. I'm, sub, he's, I'm subconsciously telling him where to go. I pop him up, he comes up here, then I open up this way. Good, palm up, good. Push my hand up, good, and then strike, good. <laughs> inside, outside, pass, inside, there you go, inside. Good. Okay. Thank you. So when it comes to the huba drill, that's where this is really starting to come into play. We want to make sure that we're able to move our hands around. This is Guru Francis, Big Boy Schemer. Until next time, peace out. God bless and keep swinging them sticks.